eBay. Um, I have today two just gear uh, storage boxes. Uh, the 120 HD versions with LED lights. Relatively good shape. Um, the material is, is fox leather, it's not real leather, it's just man made leather, man made material, whatever you want to call it. Um, they're both in pretty good shape. Um, as you can see, no real problems on the back of that one. And take a look at this one. Uh, there is one small on this one. I'm not sure if you can see it right there. One small little nick, but it's not very obvious and not a big deal. So, uh, hopefully you're watching this video before you decide to buy these, or one of them, or both of them, if you decide to do that. Uh, so, I'll give a quick demo. Um, I've got a CD in, uh, let's see, number two on this one and uh 118 so if i put it to number two i'm sure if you can see that and i hit this see it opens up and it picks up number number two okay and we'll drop it again drop that cd we'll go over here to 120 open it up As you can see, it picks up CD number 120. Okay, it's just a test to show you real fast. Um, drop that back. Over here, I've got one in, uh, I think, four. Slot number four. Open it up. <clears throat> you can see it picked up number four. Let's move one over here. Drop that. And then we'll go to number... 118. Open it up. Let's see, it picked up number 118. I don't have too many CDs. I was tempted to keep these boxes myself, but I tend to like to keep my CDs and DVDs in the boxes. Just like that. Um, it does also have the float out uh, index where you can just mark down all your, you know, which CD, which DVD, which Blu ray, whatever. Is in which slot, and that works. Over here, same thing. The float out. Label it. Uh, this one still has the sticker on it. It's just basically saying it's made leather. This one doesn't have that. It's no big deal. Uh, they also do have LED lights, so you know if it's dark, you know, and you want to. See, it's a little, it's a little easier. Not that much. It's nice to have the lights there, but it's not really necessary. But they are there. That one works. This one works as well. Let's see. Okay. Okay. Also, let's turn the light back on. Uh, when you want to change the batteries, they take triple A battery. I have a Duracell in there. It will not, I repeat, not come with AAA batteries. I'll take these out. This is just to show you how to, to, uh, to change them. Flips open, you put the battery in. When you go to close these, they're a little temperamental. You want to click it down and then push up a little bit and then push down so that the, the door closes completely. And it'll normally stay on because there's a little switch in there, Let's see it, uh, when the door is open obviously, when you close it, you shut the lights on the refrigerator, the door, I mean the light is off when the refrigerator is the door is closed. Same thing over here, you're going to change the battery, you lift it up like that, when you want to close it again, you got to be careful with these, push it. And then push up a little bit and then push down. That's why I prefer to people watch this video so they can see. 
um, how those open and close. So they're in relatively good shape. They keep 120, I guess 120 uh, discs, you know. And let's open it up again. So you'll have, you know, like one will be over here, and then two, and then three, and four, you know. Yada, 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 all the way up to 120. So uh, when you close and push them down securely, uh, I'll list them as a quantity of two. Uh, I'll just show one of them, but there's two available. So, and uh, I will charge for shipping. So that if you want one, select one. If you want two, select two. And shipping will be calculated uh, probably probably by location. I can decide whether I want to do flat rate or location. So that is about it. Thank you very much and have a great day. Bye.